Pyro Reaver! Damn you! You really are a tough bastard, you know that? Give up! It's over. Never! I will kill you, Red Ranger. Good. That's the kind of strength that I want on my team. What the hell are you talking about? My sister created you. She gave you purpose. She made you unstoppable. But only I can give you what you really want. Oh, really? And what's that? I could bring your team back. Impossible! What is this nonsense? Come with me. And you have my word, I will use all of my power to restore your family. Or don't. Just learn to live with your failure. The choice is yours. You must take me for a fool. If I join you, I still will not hesitate to kill you once I get the chance, Red Ranger. You're welcome to try. If you're done lamenting, I have your first mission for you, Psycho Red. Virgil. My name is Virgil. Call me the Red Raider. Red Raider, huh? <laughs> This should be interesting. Many years after the CTD War, the mega powers of space united under a single government called the Galactica Coalition. Under the leadership of the Premier, the Coalition's purpose is to prevent evil from reigning on a large scale ever again. As ambitions grew, the idea of using the grid for military and commercial use was made. With their power source dying, the Guardians of Good, known as Rangers, find themselves weakened and on the verge of extinction. Knowing that the Premier's intentions are more than what it seems, Andros and his team of Red Raiders fight to protect the grid and restore the balance to the universe. Mission accomplished! Headed to the extraction point, but we have a problem! I noticed. The Coalition is onto us. I thought you said there weren't any hostiles. They weren't hostile before we blew up the reactor, and now I'm being chased by Crybots! <sighs> now they're hostile. <sighs> Very hostile. Alright, stay put. I'm on my way. Don't bother. I can handle it. TK! Red Lightning Turbo Power! Nice day for a run, isn't it?
Did you guys see that reactor that blew up? Crazy, right? You guys are very talkative today. Maybe I should talk to your motherboards instead. <laughs> that was a mama joke. How the hell with this? Can you metalheads fight? So this is you handling it, huh? Yeah, why? Okay, look, man, to be fair, the crybots are different today, okay? They have this force field thing over there, none of my attacks work, and they keep getting back up. That is different. What is? I sensed a surge of grit energy. I thought it was you trying to morph. I think it was them. <laughs> you make it sound like the crap outside of GE. Good one. I think they do. What, are you serious? All right, then, what's the plan? Kill them all. Really? I'll set them up, you knock them down. Right, right. more.
Come on. I think you missed a few. Ship in the space! Let's rock it! Let's make this quick. Feeling better now? Much. Get it, man. He always told me to be careful, that we can't waste GE, but he's allowed to try to kill you with it whenever he wants. I'm not questioning you, but he sucks as a teammate. You're getting better. And I still hate you. Look, dude, am I the only one that thinks it's weird that he does that? Seriously, just me? You weren't at the rendezvous point. As you can see, we got a little held up. Do you have any problem with their defenses? They weren't even a warm-up. They weren't even a warm-up. I can't stand this guy. Good. We have a lead on another grid reactor in Sector 9B. We also need some more supplies. So we're just going to ignore the fact that the Krypos were stronger and had great energy in them? Okay. What did you say? Crybots. They were way stronger today, and Uncle Andrew said he sensed great energy in them. Weird, right? What is it? We need to talk about these. Omega, come in. Over. I repeat, R1 Omega. This is Nova. Over. 
Go for Omega. What's going on? I'm almost at the location to meet our friend. If he's as good as the rumors say he is, then the Red Raider and his annoying sidekick won't get away next time. You're just upset because that annoying sidekick got a good hit on him. You know, it's weird. I have the strangest feeling like I know that Red Fusion Ranger from somewhere. Well, you can figure out your feelings after we capture them. And hey, that was a lucky shot. Oh, looks like I'm here. Gotta go. All right, well, be careful and call me if you need backup. I'll be fine. We'll debrief when I get back. Nova out. Hope I'm not interrupting anything. Commander? It was just in the neighborhood that I'd stop by and see my two favorite time travelers. So where's your partner? She had a couple errands to run. Well, that's inconvenient. <laughs> I'm sorry. Who are you? Sam O'Neill. This. Vincent Reyes. First lieutenant of my Silver Legion division. Oh, Lieutenant Reyes. I've read about you. Your career at Lightspeed's really impressive. You were recruited by Chad Lee. Top of your class. Strong fighter. I've heard of you too. The hero of timelines. Impulsive. Reckless. But gets the job done. <laughs> That's what they say. But this time you didn't. You let the Red Raiders get away. I don't know who you think you are, but... Sam, settle down. Look, we're all in this together. We're all on the same side. If the Raiders are that easy to catch, we wouldn't need their help. Well, with all due respect, Commander, we went in blind. Nova and I came back to the past to serve with you guys because we believe that the Red Raider is the key to the destruction of our timeline. Not only do we find out that he's a rogue level 6 ranger with powers I've never seen before, we find out that he's Andros, hero of the CTD war and your former partner. Now let's just cut to the chase. You could have called and judging by this guy's attitude, I don't think this is a social visit. Now tell me the truth before we go any further. Hey, watch your tone. Vince. It's okay. What I'm about to tell you is highly classified. It does not leave this room. Do you understand? What do you know about the war criminal, Eclipter? Chief General of Dark Spectre's old UAE army. Personal bodyguard of Astronomer, Princess of Darkness. And he was killed in the final battle of the CTD war by Andros. You've done your homework. What you don't know is that we have reason to believe that Ecliptor left his children behind. A son and a daughter to be exact. Sir? Sam, you and Nova's mission is not to capture Andros, ex-Power Ranger, my old friend. Your mission is to capture the Red Raider, the heir, son of Ecliptor. By day, you become more like me. Stop this foolish crusade and embrace your destiny. Oh, that's right. You like being a failure. Is that why you couldn't save your sister? So you're telling me the Coalition can replicate Ranger powers using these cards? More or less. But the technology hasn't been perfected. Yet. And you think this has something to do with the Crybots' upgrades? The scientist I interrogated... Tortured. Interrogated. Said they were on the verge of completely controlling the Morphing Grid. That's all I got out of him before he took a nap. Nice. Guy's nice psycho. No shit. Deco, what's the ETA on our guest? Guests? Boarding code authorized. Arriving in three, 
two, one. Who knows more about the grid than grid battlefields? D! I mean, Commander Daniels. Captain Johnson. <laughs> Good to see you. Andros! Robot guy? Thanks for coming, Devin. Of course. Anything to help restore the grid? Yeah, but what are you doing here? You're taking a huge risk. If the Coalition were to find out. It's risk. Besides, I'm here with my CFO officer. Right here with me. <laughs> you didn't. He did. Hi, Betty. That's the Chief Security Officer working for you. What the hell was that for? That's for not calling me back. Dude! And that's for Pickles. Pickles. Her dog. What the hell happened to Pickles? He was missing for three days. And how was that my fault? You left your teleporter remote next to the sandwich, and you know his food anxiety. First of all, I didn't call you back because in case you haven't noticed, I'm a fugitive on the run trying to restore the greater good. Second of all, I can't help that your dog eats everything! That's a really bad excuse. It's still not your fault. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Yes. What? Can we focus? Definitely. You know, shut up. Ridiculous. What do you know about these? Where'd you get this? <sighs> I figured it out. Project Manicor. Project what? It's a project that GBF rejected when my dad was trying to move. It proposed using Morphex to weaponize the Ranger powers for military and governmental use at a large scale. Okay, I mean, that sucks, but government-sanctioned rangers isn't exactly anything new. Light speed, time force, and space branch. The big deal, it would bypass the one thing that makes you ranger. Which is? Being chosen by the grid. Power coins, swords, science. Good rangers, evil rangers. We're all rangers because the grid allows it. In Project Manicore, we give everybody access to that power. No morphers, no restrictions. It's like a gun without safety. Imagine if the Premier or an Overlord had a legion of rangers at their disposal. That's bad. Devin, do you think you can have those analyzed? See how they work? Maybe see how we can stop them? Um, I'd much rather help you fight. Me and my team are ready. Just say the word and we're ready to go. I know, I know, but right now you're a much bigger help on the inside. Just let us know what you find out. Well, if you need me, you know where to find me. May the power protect you. Glory to the Red Raiders. Say you know anything about this? The Boy Scout? Huh. No, this is the Premier's doing. They wanted absolute control, this way they have it. Draining great energy was just the first step. We have to be ready.
Virgil connected. Ship defenses online. It's about time. Shut up! Red Raiders! 